Let's begin by looking at how to set up the review for single reviewer data extraction in Extraction 2. To do this, you will need to go to the Settings button at the top of the screen. Click. Then go to the tab Review Settings. Scroll down to the bottom of the page. Make sure that you have selected Extraction 2 as your Extraction Tool. Extraction 2 can be used for any review type, including intervention, scoping and qualitative reviews. You can then change the number of reviewers required for data extraction by clicking on this selection option. Here you can see I can change from the default of two reviewers to one reviewer. Remember to click Save. You're now ready to start data extraction as a single reviewer. Now let's look at setting up the data extraction template. Whether you're a single reviewer or a dual reviewer, Setting up the template follows exactly the same process. Let's click on the studies to extract. Here you can see the blue data extraction template button. The button is blue before you publish your template. Let's click on the button now. Here is the example template that Covidence provides you with. You can use the template provided or you can adapt it to your needs by clicking on the plus symbol to add new fields. You can delete fields and you can move fields around by grabbing and dropping. The fields available are headings, subheadings, free text, single and multiple choice boxes, and you can create customized tables. You're able to in give instructions to extractors. And on the right, you'll see the preview of your template. Remember to save as draft as you go along. And when you're ready, you can click the Publish button. This will make the template available to the rest of the team who can then start data extraction. You can come back to the template and make updates at any time and then republish. Now let's begin data extraction. In the single reviewer data extraction, just as with dual reviewer, the process is the same. We've published our template and the template button is now white. I now can see that I can begin extraction with the blue button next to each reference. Let's click on the begin extraction button. We can now begin data extraction. I can see the PDF on the left and my data extraction form on the right. I can see thumbnails of the paper and the outline. I can zoom in and out of the PDF using these buttons. I can flip the PDF to better read a table or other figure. And I can look for keywords in the document. These words are highlighted. I can also move the data extraction form from side to side and I can write notes, comments here.
In order to complete the data extraction form, I can fill in each of the sections. You can easily copy and paste from the PDF into your data extraction form. Remember to click Save as you go along. When you've finished completing your data extraction form, then you can click the blue Complete button. Once you've finished data extraction, you're ready to check the data. As a single reviewer, you will not be asked to undergo a consensus evaluation. Instead, you will be asked to check all completed studies. This is to enable you to make sure that you have not missed any fields or made any errors during data extraction. Click the Begin Checking button and make any changes that need to be made. Again you will see the PDF on the left and on the right you will see the data that you extracted and the final decision. If you want to make any changes, you can simply edit the field here. If you realize you've made a mistake and you want to change again, you can simply click here on the button and the change will be automatically made. Click Save as you go along. And when you're ready, click Complete. This creates the final data that you're then able to export. Here's the study. I can view the final data. the decisions I made and I can make any edits that I want to make as well and resave if necessary. You're now ready to export your data. When you're ready to export go back to the review summary page and click on the export button. You can then select from the drop-down list here data extraction consensus only this will include your final data. Click Prepare File. A CSV file will then be prepared for you that you can download. You will be able to export this file into Excel or another statistical package in order to begin your analysis.